some extra firm tofu that I've sliced into thick slices. I'm going to place it into this hot pan so that I can sear it. Turn the tofu over after about six to eight minutes when it has become golden brown and then sear it on the other side. To make the vegan buffalo sauce, start with vegan margarine and melt it in a hot pan. Now that the margarine has melted, we'll add seasonings. This is about a half teaspoon of nutritional yeast and some garlic powder. You can use whatever kind of buffalo style hot sauce you like. Just add it directly to the margarine. Add a little apple cider vinegar for some extra zing. The vegan buffalo sauce is ready. Give it a few minutes to sit in the hot pan so that all the flavors can marry. I like to make this while I'm still searing the tofu. Add some oil to the hot pan and add in your strips of seared tofu. Pan fry the tofu until it's a little bit crispy on the sides. Tofu's had a chance to crisp up. You can see that it sort of looks like chicken strips. While it's still warm, I'm going to add in the buffalo sauce that I made. The tofu is like a sponge that's been dried out. It wants to absorb as much of the sauce as possible. So create a medium low heat environment and allow the tofu to absorb the sauce. This is a Vietnamese baguette. Place the sliced baguette onto a hot pan. Take the baguette and use your fingers to make an indent for the tofu to go into. Then we'll just take some of the tofu and put it on the sandwich.
I like to top mine with a little bit of cucumber spears. They add a nice crunch to the sandwich. They're cold and refreshing, and they are very light against the taste of the buffalo sauce. The buffalo tofu sandwich is ready. I hope you enjoyed this with a nice amber beer, some celery and carrot sticks, or whatever you love.